Here is every single new quest game confirmed for November. Bear in mind that even though these are confirmed, some games can change all of a sudden, so always double check a release date, but let's not mess around, let's go. So let's start with the Meta Quest Plus titles. This month is Warplanes World War One Fighters, which is a World War One aerial combat game, and Space Fork City, where you must build quirky floating city in space and keep your Space Fork sister sons happy. Also, Meta have now released an additional four free games that can be installed for free at all times with Meta Quest Plus, which are Guardians Frontline, No More Rainbows, Cubism, and Space Pirate Trainer. So make sure to check them out if you have Meta Quest Plus. So guys, I'm now going to announce that I'm officially part of the Quest Affiliate Program, which means you can get 10% off any app in the Quest Library and $30 of Quest Cash credit when you purchase a headset using my affiliate link. So I have put some affiliate links down in the description, but if you're looking for a specific game discount, then let me know down in the comments and I'll share one with you. So on November 1st, we saw the release of Heroes Battle Dark Sword, which is a free to play 1v1 real time strategy game where you summon monsters from the Dark Sword universe and strategically place units, cast spells to destroy your opponent's tower and climb the league rounds with unique characters and abilities. So coming up on November 6th, we got Dumb Ways to Die Free For All, where you can join up to six players in a chaotic multiplayer adventure. You can compete in holiday themed mini games across sunny beaches and wild jungles, tackling 50 unique challenges while while dodging sabotage from friends this is going to be a fun party game for you and your friends when it does drop on november 6. on november 7th we got the largely anticipated metro awakening now this is one that everyone seems to be looking forward to metro awakening sees you navigate the haunted moscow metro in 2028 as a doctor searching for medicine amid supernatural threats now guys this is one that everybody is raving about like i said the graphics look amazing everything about the game looks completely next gen definitely one worth checking out on november 7th so on november 14th we got dig vr we would take control of a digger in diglinton i like that completing various excavation jobs to grow your business you can customize your machinery explore sandbox areas and uncover hidden treasures in this immersive light-hearted environment on november 14th we got starship troopers continue um, so this game allows you to step into the Starship Troopers universe and battle deadly arachnids on Yanis 4. You can play solo or in squads and utilize a variety of weapons and psychic abilities in this squad based combat experience. Also then on November 14th we got Exo Cars. Now this is a high speed VR racing game where you race against real players in what looks to be stunning, stunning landscapes. You can compete in single player or multiplayer modes with advanced graphics and real car physics that looks like a really really fun racing experience so we got a lot of games releasing on november 21st lads first up is the thrill of the fight 2 which i know you're all looking forward to this is the og boxing experience and it's now coming with multiplayer in thrill of the fight 2 it will also be coming to early access as soon so keep an eye out for that you can customize your avatar in this one and face off against friends or test skills for online matchmaking which absolutely sounds exactly what the first game needed it's nice to see this coming to thrill of the fight 2 and that's coming on november 21st also coming on november 21st is bounce arcade pinball now this is a reimagining of class pinball with four unique vr worlds where you use your hands as paddles while navigating environments like gunpowder gulch monster mana and many others each packed with interactive mini games and thrilling action also on november 21st we got crystal commanders where you construct bases and battle in this mixed reality and virtual reality real-time strategy game also then on november 21st we've got by grit alone which is a vr action horror shooter that immerses you in a dark sci-fi narrative where you fight through terrifying derelict ships filled with alien horrors and uncover sinister mysteries in a relentless battle for survival Ooh, spooky so next up lads we got the rest of the games on this list which are stated to be coming in november according to the meta quest listing page so coming in november but is in early access is a game called songbird where you transform your living room into a karaoke stage with immersive vr singing currently available in early access with 33 master tracks and a vibrant world to explore it's perfect if you're looking for a karaoke experience in your living room or looking to test your vocal skills also coming in november 
Crack, but also is available now in early access his Trivia Crack world, where you join Willy ha, and his friends in his immersive trivia experience set in a lively park. You can compete in Trivia Tower, interact with characters, and enjoy solo or multiplayer trivia challenges that test your knowledge across various fields. Next then is Coaster Mania. This is also available in early access. We design and ride your dream VR roller coaster with realistic physics, and you can create a coaster in sandbox mode, share it online, or test your skills in puzzle mode as you navigate the game's challenges. Next then is Augmented Empire, where you step into a cyberpunk world in 2058, where you control a team of rebels, engage in strategic turn-based RPG missions, and uncover a dystopian story filled with intrigue and rebellion enhanced by an all-star voice cast sounds epic 